If your prophet said, if your prophet, if your prophet said such a stupid thing, don't you think you should all become apostates right now? No, he said, you lie. He sent it to jail for testing. If your prophet, if your prophet told you, he sent it to jail for testing. He doesn't believe that he's God. He can run him. He's competent. And he will show tomorrow. I don't believe that. No, where did you get that from? I don't believe it. No, you're lying. You're lying. Hold on. Listen, everyone. Listen. Wait, wait, wait. Sir, you you did the job. Maybe it's going to be the job. I want to ask you. Stop talking. Your brother is interested. You're too fearful. He's interested in the truth. No, I don't believe what you're saying. So if I show you. That? Right, that your prophet said such a thing. Said so what? Uh, what I just told you. I can bring it then. Oh, no. If it shows you, what will happen? Don't bring it. You've got, you've got your brother. Just show him some respect. Yeah, but if it shows you, you've got your brother. Yeah, but if it shows you, you've got your brother. Verify if it's authentic or, or if it's authenticated or weak. So, open it up. Open it up. Okay. Yeah, so I want to ask you. They're all the same. 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 they are because he can't believe his prophet would say such a thing. I'm asking. Bring it, in, bring no, it out then, innit? No, I want to know to my question. I'm going to bring it. Let's bring it then. Let's see. Right, my question is this. My question is this. Is what? Would you say that any boy that says that kind of thing is stupid to say something? Like no. I, no, I wouldn't say that. You wouldn't say that. Do you believe that that Allah will come to you like Satan? Then? No, I don't believe. So no. you don't believe it's stupid. No, I don't believe that. So if someone said that, is that stupid? No, I believe. We fear God too much. If someone said that, is that stupid? No, no, no. Answer my question. 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 Answer my what, what, what you're saying is stupid. So the question is, does it make sense? So bring it, what are you waiting for? That's what we want. What are you waiting for then? These guys are so afraid because they can't believe Muhammad would say such a thing. He would destroy the Sunnah. Destroy what Sunnah, man? What are you going to do with the Sunnah? Christianity is destroyed anyway. Christianity has no foundation. I'm asking you a question. That's my foundation. Christianity has no foundation. Right, okay. We can talk about Christianity. We're talking about this statement I asked you about. Now, I'll bring it out when I'm good and ready. I want, a, I want an answer first. No evidence. No answer. 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 In your prophet, yes, and his certain authenticity. Yes. You would lie all along. You, 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 you wouldn't care what I showed you, because yes. 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 it would make sense. Yes. 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 But he cares. Yes. You care, yes. and you're slightly afraid yes. Yes. of seeing that. Let's see that. Okay, that's my question then. I don't need to ask you a question. Right. Do you believe that Allah will come to you? No. I don't believe it. No. Right. So you don't believe it. Right. Thank you for answering. We're getting somewhere. So therefore, therefore. Okay, wait. So therefore, if I doesn't make sense. He said he doesn't believe it, and it doesn't make sense. So if right, so if your prophet said it, so if your prophet said it, you shouldn't believe your prophet, and you would say your prophet doesn't make sense. Correct? What you're saying? You're lying. You're lying. You're lying. Let me show you. No, listen. I'm gonna give it some grace. You can ask two questions. Let me show you the hadith. We want more respect for Jesus to not lose stuff like that. We wouldn't do that. We wouldn't, yes, we do. We love Jesus more than you. We love Jesus more than you. Yes, I do. Imagine you have a baby. 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 Yes. You are not going to get the ball. 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 
he's requested it be authentic. Uh, right? So I'm going to give you the reference first. It is Bukhari. Oh, can you get better than that? Hold on. Can you get better than that? Is it the right yeah. Yeah. Come here and film this. 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 Now, everyone listen. The reference is Bukhari 6573. Don't run off. Go around. You're best. Yeah. Go, go, go around. Right. Do you want to come here? Come there over here. Hello. Okay. Hold on, hold on. We'll come to them in a shape. Read the Arabic. Order the Arabic. See, he's running already to the Arabic. Let me read the Arabic. Now nah, they're gonna try and jam me out because the truth is speaking. Oh, so I'm gonna read this hadith. Oh, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Let me read the hadith for the benefit of everyone. Allah will come to them in a shape other than they know. Other than they know. There you go. This right, hold on. Hold on, hold on. I haven't finished. I haven't finished. A minute ago, he said he's going to I haven't finished. Have I haven't finished. A minute ago. A minute ago, he said he's going to You're going to get a heart attack. And we'll say, I am your Lord. Allah will introduce himself in a shape other than Muslims know and say, I'm your Lord. What will, what will happen? What will happen? They will say, they will say, we seek refuge with Allah from you. Now, who do you seek refuge from Allah from? Who? It's Satan, isn't it? Oh. Why do Muslims seek refuge? That's for you! It's this when you're afraid Jesus. that Satan is on your case. Isn't it? Right. Let me read it again. Listen, 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 listen. You know what I'm saying? 6573. This is for you. Allah will come to you. You know Allah in Jesus' shape. Allah will come. Read the whole thing. Who knows that Allah will come? He said Allah will come. He said Allah will come. The Jal will come in a shape like Jesus. That's what he's talking about. Allah will come to them in a shape other than they know. And say, I am your Lord. I they will me. say, We seek refuge with Allah from you. This is, a, this is our place. We will not follow you. People say Jesus is Lord. Muslims will fly. Allah, hold on. Wait. They believe he's Satan. Hold on. Which shape do we know right. that somebody says law no for him? Hold this on. is the fear of Islam. They want to drown me out. Everyone they say, Jesus. We will not follow you, you Jesus is Lord. till our Lord you comes to us. Jesus. And when our Lord comes to us, we will recognize him. Then Allah will come to them in the shape they know. The shape you know. Right. You know the so shape. Allah is a chameleon. Hey. Allah, Allah come to them, to Muslims, like the devil. <laughs> and then Muslims will like him. Hey. And then Allah will go away and come back like Allah. <laughs> No, you, you, you. Where the Muslims? Where the Muslims? Yes. May Allah destroy you for saying that. Yes. May Allah destroy you. Here we go. Here we go. Jesus. Here we go. Jesus. 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 Yeah. It's yeah. about you. Muhammad sucked on the tongue of his nephew. Oh! 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 Abomination! Oh! Firebird! Come on, son. 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 Come on, Read the hadith. Diversion. Yes. Don't say what. Muhammad dressed in Aisha's clothes. Like a woman dressed in drag queen. You don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing. There you go. Muhammad wore a liner. You're a god. There you go. What are you running to? Are you running to? Why are you running to? Why are you running to? Why are you running to? Am I lying? Is it true? Am I lying? Am I lying? Is it true? Am I lying? Is it true? Am I lying? Is it true? Is it true? You don't want the truth. Is it true? We are true.
Is it true? Is it true? Is it true? If it's, if it's not true, I won't say it. Is it true? Are you going to ask me, is Allah the deceiver? Are you going to ask me, are women in hell? 
Are you gonna, I've written down everything Kane said for the last three weeks. So I've got your number, mate. You've got my number? I've got, your number. <laughs> I've got it. Uh, and I've got the references. Go to, go to your thing. I'm going to come back to this hadith here. Yeah? I'm going to find it. It's there. Okay, just ask go to your question. Okay, go now can I ask you a question? Yeah. Okay. He says in 1 Corinthians. Okay. He says in 1 Corinthians, yeah? Yeah. Women should be silent. Can you explain that? Read the whole verse. Read the whole verse. You've got your thing. Come on. Read the whole verse. Okay. You want to ask me a question or do you want to say to me? I'm happy, I'm happy to be charitable. Go on, you're talking about the women here. Yeah, yeah, I, I actually generally I Jokes aside, hype aside, I actually want to know. And I could, I'm, I'm, if you give me a reasonable explanation, like... Right, guys. Okay, okay. Uh, before we go here, I found a hadith. Glory to God. So let me read it. And then we'll go on to the women, okay? Oh wait, wait, now, wait, wait. wait minute, Kate, Kate, Kate. Are you, yes, sir. Are you here to learn? Are you here to... Will you change your perspective if I could prove you wrong? I'm willing to learn. I'm not gonna hear, I'm not here to bash Christianity because I've got a lot of Don't put no bash. conditions here. I follow the one true living God, Jesus. He so, needs to so, repent so, and be baptized in his holy right, name. So he's not or you will surely be burned. You will surely go into a lake of fire. So I'm here to help you. I'm actually here to help you. Okay, cool. Right, let me read the hadith. Let me read the hadith. It is Sahih Muslim. Sahih Muslim, yeah. Now, how authentic is that, sir? Sahih Muslim. It is, according to Sheikh Hamza, right? Who is. Who? You don't know who Sheikh Hamza is. I can tell everyone who Sheikh Hamza is. Sheikh Hamza, right? Has studied Hamza, has studied Hamza, a Mufti, right? From the Saudi Arabian University. He has high credentials. He's probably the West most prolific Islamic scholar. Which Look it up on Yusuf Hamza. Oh, Sheikh Yusuf Hamza. Oh. There's no Let me read it. He says that Sahih Muslim. He says that Sahih Muslim is 98 or so percent correct. So you can trust in Sahih Muslim. And this is what your prophet said in Sahih Muslim. You've already said that it's stupid, and you already said you don't believe it. When. Right. Hudafi B. Usaid reported directly from Allah's messenger. You for the chain. Don't, don't put me directly, that's the chain. Directly from Allah's messenger that he said, when the drop of semen remains in the womb for 40 or 50 days. Do I need to read? I'll give you the reference. The reference is Sayyid Muslim 2644. Now, who here believes that semen lived in a womb for 40 days? What do you think, John? I just said I don't believe it. Do you believe that? I, I just said I don't believe it. No. How dumb? This is what you mean. You Come on, Muslims, defend him. Is this, is, this, is, this, is this the way how Christians speak? No. I'm asking you. I'm asking you. I'm asking you. So, don't you think that's a dumb okay. statement? First, can I reply? Yeah. Okay. First of all, it's Hamza Yusuf. Yeah. Yeah. I used to organize his talks in Kitta to Dan Hu. I don't care about your credentials. Answer the question. I don't care about your credentials. Answer the question. question. Do you believe that sperm lives so, in the womb for 40 Yusuf days? Tanya, for the record, Hamza Yusuf is a great scholar, but right. okay, he good. follows a but certain way. Yeah. What is his way? He follows. What is his way? He follows. His way he follows. Sorry? I'm a Hanafi. No, he... I'm a Hanafi. Right. I follow the school of Imam Abu Hanifa. In in our school. Do you follow Sahih okay, Muslim? Okay. Listen to what I'm saying. Do you follow Sahih you Muslim? Answer, if you allow me to speak. In our school, we are critical of a lot of hadith, be it in Bukhari, be it in Muslim. So now you're stuck. How? Now you're stuck. I'll tell you why you're stuck. Why? Because we, we go through the chains. So you can quote as many hadiths. Are you listening I've, to, I've told you are you listening to this man throw Sayyid Muslim under the bus? Yeah, yeah. Because he knows that Sheikh sperm Al does not live in a world Sheikh, for three days, Sheikh, Sheikh but he can't abide it. Okay, okay, he can't okay, take it. Okay. So he's willing to throw Sahih Muslim under the bus. Okay. Are you right? gonna, am I going to speak? Are we going to have a Do you believe that sperm lives in a world for 40 days? So Imam Al-Badi, Sheikh Uthameen, uh, Imam Jassas, these are all great authorities within the Islamic world. They will reject the deeds of Sahih Muslim and Sahih Bukhari. The only authentic world we follow is the Quran. No, no. This man, this Muslim has said it's not a jar of pickles. So he believes. It's a stupid statement. 
101, 101. We said 101. Why are you running? Sir, I've got your number. I've got your number. I've got your number. I've got your number. Now answer me. Oh. Right, 1 Corinthians. Oh. Or 1434. This guy is a jackass. No, no, no. no, no. I've been sent a jackass. You're the one that's jumping right? up and down. I want to discuss You're with stuck. somebody. Stuck. I've just given you a reference from Sahih Muslim. That the sperm lives in the womb for 40 days. And Muhammad said it. No. Now I want you to either say it's a good statement or a stupid statement. Stop dancing around the region. So I know what you know. So I understand what you know what you're talking about. Do you believe sperm lives in the womb for 40 days? Tell me how hadith works. Don't change the subject. No, no. You don't know what you're talking about. Don't change the subject. Hadiths have chains. Yeah? These have chains are. the best you got. No, no, listen. the best you got. Learn, learn, learn. Is this the best you got? You learn. Right, that's Today, it, I'm the Undertaker, I'm going to bury you alive, yeah? Right? Yeah, you know that's what Yeah, make him, make him, joker. chain. You know today's your burial day. Yeah. You haven't probably, said anything. Probably I'm Muslim, yeah, so I don't want to get trouble. Oh my word. Yeah. Anyway. Pride and arrogance. What's the you? It's called swagger. I've just told you. I've just told you. It's a numbskull. Guys, I'm going to end this discussion because I don't want to talk to a numbskull. I've got all of everything he's going to say. Oh, you're a prophet. I'm not going to waste my time. I'm not going to waste my time. Come here, bro. Come over here. Come over here. Thank you, guys. Thank you for this. Come over here. Come here. I've just told this man. I just I've told this man number, right, to a stupid statement that his prophet said that sperm lives in the womb for 40 days. Rather than say it's stupid, because another Muslim has already said that it's not a Excuse me, have some respect. I've already, another Muslim has already said that sperm is not a jar of pickles. So it really is an inane statement. But he refuses. He refuses to say so because he can't criticize his prophet. I've got all these references. He needs to leave his arm and leave a prophet. That was faking Some prophethood and well, come to Jesus Christ. Because he's the way, the truth, and the life. And it's only truth in Jesus. Amen.